Hey, welcome back to Growing Organic, everybody. I got something cool to show you right now. I was walking around my garden this evening and came across something really cool. Well, what, I wouldn't say cool, but it's um, cool to look at. I'm gonna get a close-up of this, but you can see these flowers here. This is called a cape or a honeysuckle gold flame. So it's got these really nice flowers here. But I also notice over here, there's one flower that's missing, completely broken off and gone. And if you look up closer, it is because there is a giant grasshopper eating it. And this thing is really big. This thing's like two, two three inches long. I'm gonna probably have to kick this guy out of here soon because it looks like he's going for more. He's gonna just keep eating all night, looks like. So if you leave him here, these, these guys can do quite a bit of damage. Here he is, he's, he's climbing up, getting some more. He's gonna start chewing on this plant, look at this. This guy doesn't mind a, a flashlight in his face. He's just gonna keep doing his thing. Look at his long legs. So he's standing on this plant that's amazing. Standing on his hind legs. Look at that. That's incredible. See, normally he's, he's laying forward, but now he stood up straight. I've never seen anything like that. It looks like a, like a chicken or something. And look at how long his leg is right there. It's like they're almost straight. He's got his long legs. He's using the branch, or the this leaf is like a, a platform to stand on. So he's get, keeping his balance. And then going straight up, high as he can, just to chew on this thing. Just chewing away. Look at that, he's just knocking down on this. So I encourage you guys to always be in your garden every day if you can and just take a close-up look and see what's going on see what type of problems you're having because things change quickly out here and you could leave for a few days or a week and come back and all of a sudden all your your flowers are all gone and you wonder why but since he ate this one pretty much all the way we'll just let him continue but I'm gonna to try to get some National Geographic style close-ups with my camera here to see if we can get his face I want to get a real close-up Still see how he's just standing on his his hind legs there. Look at that. He's got he's like sprawled out and just balancing perfectly on these like sticks. So he's got one foot there, one foot over there, and he's got these other long arms holding onto the branches up here. So he can just chew these flowers right off for a day. But that is the cool thing.
Okay, back the next day, and guess what? He moved over here. He already ate this one. Now he moved over to here, and he blends in so well that you can't even really see that he's there. He's almost exact same color as the leaf. He's been eating all day. Now he's going through a lot of food. One little cricket. I'm, one, I'm sorry, one large grasshopper. So this is day two of this one grasshopper eating this entire flower. really blends in. It's really hard to see this unless you look up close. The colors almost match identical to the uh, color of these leaves. Alright, well that's about it everybody. We'll see you guys next time. Bet you enjoy that. Thanks for watching. Hit that subscribe button and we'll see you guys on the next video.